Good morning, oil traders. It is 9.05 a.m. here on the East Coast on October 26th. It's Thursday. It's the day after Newsday, and as you guys may know, Newsday's news was bearish, um, but we didn't get any real reaction from the markets, um, so maybe we'll get that today. Um, I'm not necessarily saying that we're going to go um, down because the news was bearish. We've seen the, uh, the contrarian effect um, well in play uh, over the past few weeks, so we may very well go up. Um, but yeah, as of yet, um, no real movement, um, no new lows, no new highs in uh, Asian trading or European trading sessions. Um, and right now we're opening basically where we closed yesterday um, at about 52.20-ish. Um, we've touched towards 52, we've touched upwards towards 53, uh, 52.30. Um, so really the bulls and the bears are still battling it out and um, but we should get something um, I would say um, leading into European uh, close at 11:30 a.m. Eastern time by then I would expect that either we're up above 52 and a half or well below 52 that's my guess um, as you guys know my targets are still unchanged I'm looking at uh, 51 and a half or lower in order to sell some shorts, uh, closer to 51 in terms of buying long. And if we do go up, um, then I'll be looking for around 53 um, at uh, for a price at which to add to my short positions, which are um, exclusive to my portfolio right now. I'm definitely looking to rebalance and add some um, long positions as well as exit some shorts. So hopefully I get my plays today. Um, but let me know what you guys think. Hit me up down below in the comments on YouTube or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, performance, uh, results, etc., etc. In the meantime, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys after the trading session towards the end of trading at 4 p.m. Eastern. Until then, good luck. Cheers.